Hello there, YouTube. This is the masked GUI because the masked guy was taken as a YouTube name, so I had to go with the thing that sounded most like it. And it's a slightly little computer, and it's a slight computer term too. But anyway, yeah, this is the masked GUI, and this is my second playthrough series, or well, the first episode, the pilot of my Let's Play Minecraft, which is going to be a combination of tutorial and let's play. So I mean like I'm not great at it yet but I'm going to be playing through it and I'll also be talking through what I'm doing. So without further ado let's start my new world, Minecraftia. Yeah? I don't really know if the seed is going to change anything but I'm just going to name it after myself. You know because I'm just that vain. Um, Yeah and so we'll see what kind of terrain it builds for me. As you can see as well, everything looks different because I'm using the um, DokuCraft texture pack and I think it kind of makes it kind of makes it look like kind of old anime style RPG type thing and it also makes um, things... Hey, I spawned on what looks like a cliff. Let's wait, let everything load off for a second. But yeah, it also makes like or the texture pack makes ores and things look clearer. Hey, look, it's what looks like jack o' lanterns. I'm gonna go over there. Ooh, more jack o' lanterns. I'll take these ones because they're closer. Also, I saw a video recently, and I'll see if it actually works. Because yeah, apparently you can put them on your head, and I want to see if that actually works. Well, I mean, I know it worked then, but I'm not sure if they changed that since, because it looks funny. I'll fly over here to these pumpkins, and then I will start my actual survival, because it's on normal difficulty. So, I mean, when the sun sets, there will be monsters, and they will be out to get me. Like any good monster should. So... I'll just skip around this way, so I won't have to go swimming, because swimming is a lot slower than walking in this game. That's what the boats are for, but I can't make a boat out of pumpkins. Hmm. Unless... No, you can't. Real pumpkin. You should be able to eat pumpkins or something, instead of just using them as decorations. Nope, not a jack-o'-lantern among them. Unless they actually are, and this texture pack just doesn't have support. I don't know. I'll try it. Hey, it does. I mean, it just looks like a regular pumpkin. Oh yeah, also, that's my um custom skin. Yeah, I made it myself. I mean, the hat is 2D because I didn't know how to make it stick up. But I have the mask and the green coat and stuff. Eee! Rare, I got my pumpkin. I shall haunt your dreams and eat your family. Nom nom nom. Um, it kind of obscures your sight a bit, but it still looks hilarious. Anyway, I'm going to take it off. Eh, no, I'll keep it on for a bit. Um, do we go with this tree? Yeah, digging in this tree takes quite a Digging trees takes a fair bit. I mean, when you get better axes, it's fine. But at the start, it takes a little while. But it's okay, because it's necessary. Okay, yeah, now it's distracting me. I'm going to take that off. There we go. Back to normal. Now then, I'll just have to find somewhere to make a decent home. This mountain, right here in front of me, looks unusually geometrically sound. I mean, it's almost a square for us. It's almost a square as far as I can tell. Or almost a rectangle, whatever. But the fact it has uh, such flat walls, I'm seriously impressed, because normally things are very, um, steppy. And although there are some steps, there's not half as many as there are in other things. Uh, I thought I could get in here. Oh, oh right, it's up there. Oh well, time to dig upwards. And then place underneath. It's like the number one mode of transport in this game. 
Ooh, this place is cool. Now all I have to do is find some coal. I mean, there is some on that unusual structure over there that just seems to go straight up. But I'm not going over there, so I'll just dig this stuff up instead. So, I mean, the first kind of essential of Minecraft is... I mean, you get wood, but wood is useless. So you have to make it into wooden planks. Then you go wooden planks. And then you stack them up like that, one on two vertical. And you can make sticks. And then sticks... Oops, I forgot to make a workbench. A workbench is one in each of them. And you can create a or crafting table, whatever, sorry. And yeah, you get achievement for it the first time you do it. There's not a whole lot of achievements yet, but I'm sure there'll be more. Then you can make sticks, if you arrange sticks like that as a handle. And then put planks on top. And you can make things, like a wooden pickaxe. And a wooden hoe just for the sake of the achievement. And then you can also make a wooden sword, shovel and a wooden sword. And I think that's all of the tools that you can get. And you know, the pickaxe is used for digging through stone obviously, the hoe is used for farming, the shovel is used for digging through dirt, and the sword is for fighting things. Pretty obvious, but you know. I thought there'd be no harm in going through it anyway. You see, these black blocks now here are, are coal that I'm picking up. They don't always look like this, but on this texture pack they do. But even on the regular one, you'll know you'll be able to see straight away what stone looks like. And then coal stones with coal in them will be basically just that. You'll be able to see little black kind of dots in it. And then the same with iron, it'll be kind of faint orangey kind of dots, I suppose, I'd say. I suppose that's what colour they'd be. And then there's gold, which is more golden colour. Diamonds would be blue. Um, redstone is red. So yeah, there's all the diff- you sure I mean you can see it pretty clearly straight away. And as well, I'll pick up some cobblestone, just so I can make some better tools. I mean, there's different classes of tools. There's wood, cobble, or well, stone. Um, gold, which is just fancy looking, but not great as a material. There's iron, and there's diamond, which is the best. I think that's all. And you can also make armor out of all those, all said things as well. Well, you can't make wooden armor. You can make, the easiest armor to make is leather which you get from cows, obviously. Now then, I don't have to go onto a workbench to make um, torches, but I will anyway. There we go, I can only make four, unless I make more planks. But anyway, I'm gonna stick with, oops. I'm gonna stick with this and make a stone pick and a stone sword. And I suppose with this leftover stick, I'll make a few more torches. Now this place does look cool, but it doesn't really, I don't really think it seems sound... Oh wait, that's one other tool I forgot to make. There is also, I don't have enough wood and planks to make it, so I'll just use stone. There's also a wooden axe, or different types of axe, whatever. But yeah, there's also axes that I forgot to mention which are used for chopping down trees quicker. Anyway, this place is cool, but it's too open-ended, so I'm gonna cut up this workbench. You can cut up the workbench and pick it up and place it again wherever you want. And I'm gonna find somewhere else that might be... Whoa. Oosh. Oops, I was about to swear there by mistake. Slip of the tongue, but yeah. I mean... Yeah, oh, something, insert word there for when you fall off an edge like that. If you want to heal up, there's pigs everywhere, you can kill them and sometimes they drop pork, which you can then use. You can either just eat raw or cook. Cooking it gets you more health when you eat it. And raw, I think raw like heals one or two and then cooking it gets you like five or something-ish. Hmm. Okay, maybe not. I was thinking this looks like a nice safe little hole, but apparently it leads me into a cave. Although, it might, looks like I might 
it takes me out here but at the same time I think I might be safe enough in here if I close it up oh yeah it takes me out to a completely different area I'll just grab this coal and then I'll go back into the place that I the kind of closed off part I think as it's my first video I will um, split this into two parts just to kind of cover the day and night of it so in that case I think I might just cut this video off here and I'll continue part two facing this bit of coal okay so see you all soon goodbye